It's DVD update time again. What's going on, everybody? Frank Sausen here. And uh, I don't have many DVDs that I got this week, but I got uh, a few uh, because, like I said, I've been trying to cut back a little bit on uh, buying DVDs. I'm kind of working more towards, uh, well, the new TV, but uh, uh, mostly just uh, uh, right now, just building up my nostalgia collection. Uh, right now, I have two posters that, uh, that you'll see later on, not in this video or whatnot, but in another video later on, I'll do a maybe a video of all my posters or something like that that I got thus far. But uh, I got a Star Wars poster. Now I'm not a huge fan of Star Wars, but I like the series, I like the poster, the artwork or not, because back in the day, artwork on a poster or a movie told uh, more of a story than they did, you know, than, than nowadays and when you see a, a poster. Then I got uh, the, uh, they released uh, one of the Terminator 4 posters. And because I'm a fan of the series, because I got all, the first three on DVD anyway, and I will get the uh, last one on DVD when it comes out, and probably be lucky enough to see the movie next month when it comes out, I got that poster too. But anyway, I'm not here to talk about my posters, I'm talk, here to talk about some of the new DVDs I got. And the reason why I was able to get some of these DVDs is because I sold my record collection. Now I've been meaning to sell, uh, my vinyl record collection, now I've been meaning to sell this collection for a while. I got it from a friend, and uh, you know, and... I've had it for a while, and I like vinyl records. There ain't nothing wrong with vinyl, but I listen to all my music on a computer, you know, which is great and, and because uh, uh, in, in another video, uh, because this is a two-parter, well, this is a DVD update, but it's also a bonus video as well uh, that I want to share with you guys, something that I just thought was kind of funny, you know, and I don't know if YouTube will, you know, uh, YouTube doesn't seem to like uh, copyrighted stuff, but you know, I don't think it's going to be a big deal, you know, so, anyway, <laughs> uh, but I sold my vinyl record collection, I got 150 bucks for it, I sold like 200 records or whatever, so, you know, everything works, so I got some groceries, but then I, I put some money away for some uh, movies or DVDs, the first DVD I got is the greatest, WWE's greatest superstars in the 90s. And it's how, you know, I do have, as you all, many of you know, I do have the uh, Greatest Wrestling Stars of the 80s as well, which uh, is, this is the second part to that series, uh, which was talking about, like, guys like Hulk Hogan, Greg Valentine, uh, Rick, well, not Rick Flair, but, like, uh, you know, like, Junkyard Dog or whatnot, Rod Piper. Well, this one talks about guys like uh, Yoko Zuna, Owen Hart, Mick Foley, Eric Bischoff. Lex Luger, Stig, Scott Hall, Kevin Nash, and of course the usuals, you know, Bret Hart and Vince McMahon and Stone Cold Steve Austin, Hulk Hogan, Triple H, whatever. But uh, it's very, it's very good, and uh, I watch a part of it now. I, it also includes, uh, well, the documentary. See, that's what I like when I buy a rest of the DVDs when I get a chance to. Uh, I, I like more the documentary, the style of how they introduce the. The, uh, the video, you know, how they introduce the ser or the the, the uh, episode that they're talking about. Um, now, I don't really care so much for, you know, I mean, I do like the matches or the bonus stuff, but I do like the documentary a lot more, so that's why I watch that. But they have some great matches out here. I do recommend it. Uh, WWE just released this on Tuesday, this past Tuesday. Uh, so it, it's very, you know, it's very good. And maybe I can open it up for you. I don't normally do this, but show you what it looks like inside in case you uh, ever are interested. It has uh, Hulk Hogan, Undertaker, Scott, or Ray, or Scott Hall, Kevin Nash, Yokozuna, Shawn Michaels, Vader, Sting. I mean, there's, you know, and then show you kind of what the inside looks like. It comes with a booklet and then three DVDs. I get the first one in my player right now. So it's pretty good, you yeah. know? And, uh, yeah. So, anyway, so I recommend picking up Greatest Superstars of the 90s for WWE because, as you all know, I'm a big wrestling fan. Uh, I love, well, I've been watching it for a long time. And it talks, you know, I've been waiting for a DVD to talk about, you know, uh, you know, like guys like Owen Hart and, and uh, Yoko Zuna because those guys don't get enough. Uh, how, how many of you people agree with me 
that watch wrestling back in the nineties and think that they go way too overboard on some of the DVDs that they do documentaries. They always focus on the top superstars, you know, like Undertaker, Shawn Michaels, you know, Bret Hart, whatever. And I do love Bret Hart, you know, and I do love all the top superstars too. But there's superstars like Owen Hart, you know, and Yokozuna and, and Mabel and uh, the Head Shrinkers and the Steiner Brothers and and Sting and uh, uh, Rick Rude and you know. So many superstars. I heard that there's rumors that they're going to make a Macho Man Randy Savage DVD. But there's so many superstars that they haven't talked about or made a DVD of that they should, you know. Because there are a lot of other superstars that, are, that were popular too. Or even if they weren't popular, that made an impact. And, and people like Owen Hart and Yoko Suda definitely made an impact. And did you know that uh, it'll be 10 years uh, next month on the 23rd of May since Owen Hart passed away? I don't know if you guys knew that, so there you go. The next DVD I got, I, I picked a few from the $5 bin at Walmart. So I'm going to go through these as quick as I can, just because of time. I got I Spy with uh, Eddie Murphy and uh, Owen Wilson. Uh, I've seen it before, you know, many times before, but I figure it's $5. Very good movie. It's supposed to be based on the uh, the old show with Bill Cosby from the 60s, but it gives its own twist on it, too. The other doc, uh, DVD I got was... The American President, starring Michael J. Fox, uh, Michael Douglas, uh, Annette Bening, and Martin Sheen. I haven't seen it, but I've seen a little bit of it, you know, here and there through YouTube. It's very, it looks very, very good. Uh, let's see what else I got. I got the movie The Ringer with uh, Johnny Knoxville. It's supposed to be pretty funny, I heard. Haven't seen it. Don't really know much about it. I know that it has to do with Special Olympics, and I don't know if, they're, if they make fun of it or whatever, but... I guess I'll have to find out. A lot of these I haven't even opened yet because I just got them yesterday. Uh, and then I did get two documentaries because I who doesn't love a good documentary, especially around this time of the year, you know? Springtime is always a good time to, to whip out the old documentaries and watch some of the documentary films. I got the first one uh, called Thunder Transformation. Change My Ride Now. It's, it's like a spinoff of Pimp My Ride. Which I think this show was uh, saw, seen on the Speed Channel. And then the other one, the final DVD that I got, was the America's Greatest Motorcycle Rallies. And this covers like Sturgis, South Dakota, and Florida, and you know, California, places that they've had bike rallies. And since I'm a big fan of stuff like that, because I've been to Sturgis many, many times, because they had family down there, uh, even around the time when WCW did the pay per views over there. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's just, you know, who doesn't love a good bike rally? That's pretty much all the DVDs I got. Uh, stay tuned for this next uh, for the next video I'm going to make because, it's a, because I got over 100 subscribers. I want to do something special. That's my way of saying thank you to you subscribers. So come back here in just a sec on part two. Well, part two of my update, but it's not really an update. It's going to be titled something different. So come back here in a sec and... Uh, Enjoy the next video I have to offer for you guys.